So we are back today with Vlogmas. I'm doing Vlogmas this year, clearly. So today's Vlogmas day number one. So I want to start off by showing you guys the Christmas stuff because during Vlogmas, probably like next week, I have the Christmas tree up, but I'm gonna already do some of the stuff now, like the decor stuff. So I did buy new things. If you guys watched the vlog that I posted up yesterday, you guys would have seen. I bought a Christmas tree and I bought like a whole bunch of other stuff, but I didn't show you guys in the vlog what I got. So I'm gonna show you guys everything I got today. Um, and then we're going to put some of this stuff up and then I'll kind of show you guys, um, what it looks like. Um, like I said, the Christmas tree is going to take like a few more days because I got to get some more balls because I don't have enough. Like the Christmas tree I had before was a smaller Christmas tree and this one is like big. Um, so I need some more balls. I thought this was going to be enough, but then I looked at the ones that I had and I just don't have enough in general. So I need some more of these, and I think I want to add more color to it. Maybe add like a little accent red. I wasn't going to do red and stuff like that. I was going to keep it just kind of like gold, silver, a little splash of red. Like some of my um, ornaments have like a little bit of red in it and white and stuff like that. But now I'm thinking I kind of want to add like red, like a little bit of red. Not too much crazy red, like bright red um, ornaments, but just kind of like little subtle red ornaments because I think that would be kind of cute. So I'm going to look for some of those, but... For the most part, I think everything I got is pretty much cute. The Christmas tree is different. It's not going to be like that kind of like white frosted one I had last year. So this one's a plain one, but I'm going to frost it myself. I'll show you guys how I frost it. And yeah, so let me get this ready. All right, guys, so I got to get right here so I can kind of show you guys the stuff that I got. I went to Target. I mostly got most of the stuff at, at home because at home I had some really nice stuff. So um, <clears throat> they also had like a little bit of a sale. Some of the, the fall items are like 50% off. And I think like some of the Christmas things were on sale. I didn't really get any of like the pillow decor or anything like that. I usually go to Ikea to get stuff like that. So I'm going to do that later. I'm not even going to do that now. So I did, like I said, I got some balls. I got the um, shatterproof one, six piece. This was just kind of like gold sparkly with like white like snowflakes on it, which I thought was really cute. So I picked this one out. I'm not sure if it's not going to show up. Y'all yeah, see, y'all yeah, yeah, see. Um, I also got these silver ones with like a little bit of a gold spidery effect on it as well too. The, these were $7.99 and these were $5.99. Hence that they're kind of like, you know, I got a little bit of a razzle dazzle to it. So it's going to be like a little bit more expensive. So I thought these were cute too. Like I said, they're kind of like silver with like a little bit of gold spidering effect on it, which I thought was really cute. If you watch the vlog, you would have seen them when I picked them out. Very, very cute guys. I wanted something like this to go with kind of like my gold and silver theme. But like I said, I'm going to add a little bit of red because I feel like I'm going to need some red. But yeah. So I also got this really cute little sign because I usually like to do like a little bit of like a, like a design on that um, my entryway table so i thought this was cute it was only five dollars it's just something because i was like you know y'all so i thought this was cute to put up on the entryway i also got this nutcracker the nutcracker was 12.99 he's definitely cute he's a brother whatever um i thought it was really really cute just like a little bit of decorish in here trying to give it the more Christmassy effect in here uh, this year, you know, it's a new year, it's a new me, you know, so I thought that this was really, really cute, this was $12.99, usually I would not pay $12.99 for this, but I was like, it's cute, I'm gonna do it, so I got that, um, I also got this reef, this reef was $24.99, I'm actually gonna put this on the door tonight, um, I thought it was absolutely stunning, guys, the dry, the nice, pretty snowflake uh, style, crystal, crystallized, snowflakes on here it also has like these cranberries i thought it was like really rusticky and cute um uh to have two reasons i want to show you a reef i have here and a reef that i had last year so it kind of has like this snowflake crystallized uh, look which i absolutely love definitely kind of still goes with my kind of like you know my boho farmhouse type of apartment style so i thought this would be really cute to put on the door so i'll show you guys when i put this on the door so so cute um what else i got i also got a few ornaments but which ones are that? I got this one right here. This one ornament from at home, which is really, really cute. It's like an acorn. Like I said, very rustic and bohemian style. You know what I mean? Like farmhouse style. I thought that this was really cute. What else did I get? Yeah. So I, like I said, I got a reef. I was looking for a nice reef. This reef is also frosted as well. 
I thought it was really cute. It was $19.99 for this one at home. So I'm going to put this either on my TV stand. Um, I have another one from last year that I'm going to actually put on the front entryway so I can kind of give it more of like a Christmassy vibe there. But this one, I'm going to put it right here just because I feel like it'll go good on my uh, TV stand. But you guys can see it is a nice frosted along with the cranberry. Love that little cranberry frosted look. I think it's really nice. Definitely brings the fall look all together, you, um, the winter look or Christmas look. So I thought this was cute. And like I said, it kind of matches the, um, the actual um, reef that I got. Not the reef, the thing for the door. Um, I got something from the dollar store, but this was, where did I get this one? Oh, I got this one from my home. So I just got this little piece of wood that says peace on it. Nothing crazy. I thought that this was cute. So this is just a simple ornament. This ornament was $1.99. So some of their ornaments are actually cheap. Um, I did go to the dollar store and pick up ornaments from the dollar store as well. If you have not been to Dollar Tree, hopefully you get there early enough because the Dollar Tree, they have very inexpensive ornaments and things like that. So I definitely recommend you guys get your hands on it. They had these two black angels, which I thought was super cute at the Dollar Tree. I was like, word, get in it. They also have this cute little farmhouse bag that just says on it, farmhouse Christmas, which I thought was super cute for $1.25. Come on. Very cute. And then I also got this kind of cute little uh, gold with a little bit of that red in the inner gut part. I thought this was really cute. But what really got me was these two black angels. Like, come on. These are the cutest black angels ever. So I got two of those. Um, you guys know that I always like to get these for my plants or for my vases, my vase that are up here. So I had to get a whole bunch of these. The Dollar Tree sells these are only $1.25. And if you just want to do like your own assortment of flowers, I recommend getting these. You got your cranberries, you got your regular flowers, your acorns, all that kind of stuff. I pr pretty much go in and get like a handful of these just because they make sense, especially when you got fake flowers for your vase. I'll show you guys how I set these up in the ones that I have. And you guys always make fun of the cotton. and the cotton is actually really embarrassing. They gotta do something about that because that's real embarrassing, but I still got it anyways. But these are gonna the Dollar Tree. Um, they're dollar twenty-five. You know how that goes. I thought this was really cute from the Dollar Tree, guys. I thought it was like a nice, simple little Christmas sign to put up. I usually like to put stuff like this up on my door, so I might put this one on my door. I'm not really sure yet, but I'm pretty sure that's what your girl's gonna do. But I thought that this was really, really cute just to put up on the door. Dollar twenty-five. You really can't beat that. I did go ahead and pick out some LED uh, lights. These had a, like a really nice look to them. I got these from Target. They're the green wired one. Obviously, obviously I need the green wired ones for my um, tree. Um, these are, I thought the crystals on these were really pretty. I wanted, was looking for something nice and like kind of fancy looking. So I thought that these kind of gave like a little bit of like a fancy look to them, these um, lights. So I picked these out and I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and try these lights out this time. I was looking for more of a fancy light. And these are LED as well too, so yeah. So that is basically, oh, that is not everything that I got. You can't. I got an extender as well too, because you know I'm gonna need an extender for the tree, everything, so I have to get one of these. And the tree is what I got. The tree was, I think like $89.99. Um, the tree is basically a seven and a half foot tree. It's a Norwegian slim spruce tree. Now I wanted a slim tree just because I feel like the slim tree will look better. Sometimes when you get like the wider trees, it just kind of looks real gappy in the middle. So I wanted to try something different, a little bit skinnier and taller. So I got this one. Um, like I said, I'll show you guys when I put this up. I'll do like a complete tour of it. You guys will absolutely love it. So I thought that this was really, really cute, guys. So I got this one. My last tree was maybe like five feet. So this one's definitely way taller than that one. I think it would just look better. Stack higher with more things on it. I think that would just look cute. I just realized that I forgot that I don't have a star. So I have to get a star. So that's the next thing that I need to get. But other than that, this was everything that I picked up as far as decor. And I think that's all I really need.
really cute i feel like cutting the strings off of there i'm gonna cut them in a few minutes with a pair of scissors but this is basically what i had in my own apartment i just kind of rearranged everything in here i am going to get batteries that actual reef lights up so once i get the batteries it'll light up and i think that this looks really cute left the basket my keys whatever i'm going to get three cheap throw blankets that are very thin right and I'm just going to line them up inside of there just to line it so that it, you can't see the inside of the baskets. I thought about that after, just like a cover-up. So I'm just going to get three very inexpensive throw blankets at um, Primark tomorrow, any type of inexpensive store, even like five below. Just a quick throw blanket that's holiday festive or just like a nice neutral tone and just drop them on top just to cover. I did that in my office and I think it looks really good. But this so far, this is everything that I already had, so I feel like it's giving very much... A Christmas vibe once I add the batteries to this item it's gonna light up and be so beautiful so I'm gonna grab that uh, tomorrow morning um, a quick pair of batteries so that I can light that up uh, you can either plug it in or light it up but I'm just gonna um, do batteries I'm sorry I said plug it in so that looks really good and then over here looks really really good as well guys um, put the reef up there we have our two fake poinsettias added the plant on the other end over there my little a nutcracker dude and one of the ebony woods candles and then i have this right here which is the um dried uh flowers from trader joe's they had them made a cute little arrangement and it looks pretty good guys i absolutely love this so i think this came out cute obviously i have to change the throw blankets and stuff like that but i'm going to work on that but i wanted to actually get like some of the base down first and I absolutely love it. I will be adding some lights to the reef. The reef did not come with lights in it. So I'm going to add some lights to the reef. Just like kind of mix it into there. And yeah. So I'm going to add some more lights and stuff on that end. But for the most part, I love it. I love the reds. The reds are just bringing in more of a festive look. So, yep. <coughs> and I did go ahead and leave this like this because I have to put this up. So... This box down there was all my old Christmas stuff, so I have some fall stuff in there. So I'm going to leave that like that so I don't forget that I need to get to that. Um, I want to also show you guys a few other things that I got. 
when I went to, I told you guys I have the 50% off fall stuff. So these candles were only like five bucks, guys. They were originally $10, so I got it for $5, which is good. I went to Target, I got some Thermal Breath. I heard this is actually really good, so I got this. Kind of on the expensive side, but it is what it is. Some Aveeno. Need to re-up on the lotion. It's getting real dry out here and real cold. I also got the Vaseline Cocoa Radiant Body Oil. I want to try this one. Is this open? No. So I wanted to try this one out. I've had it before, but it's been a while. I also got some all-purpose, multi-purpose contact solution. And one last thing that I recommend to you guys. Get these leggings, y'all. Get these leggings from Target. These leggings, I'll leave a link down below. They're so freaking sturdy. The best leggings in store. Thick waistband, quality black leggings. So, y'all need to get your hands on these Target leggings, baby. Wait, before you go, don't forget to come back, guys.